Hello everybody and welcome back to the Long War. So we are going to try to deal with a landed scout today, which means we might run into an ambush. So I'm trying to bring a pretty strong squad, but still have a decent squad ready for the next mission as well. And we are bringing an arc forward to this mission. So we have Reuter, our scout. We have Kim, our engineer with the arc thrower. We have Cusack the Gamer as our Rocketeer, we have Friendly as our Medic, Double Down is our Assault, Deadbolt is our Sniper with uh, Disarming Shot, and we have Tuna, our Gunner with uh, Psionic Abilities, and we have Shang, our Covering Fire Infantry. So, yeah. Sometimes when uh, the aliens have landed they have pretty strong forces and also they Francis usually like request. to um, run Looks against like you like out in the boonies. We need to get multiple pods against you any so they the local it's much more dangerous than uh, crash sites so if you are unlucky we will have to fight multiple Strong squads pretty early here. HQ, this is Big Sky. We are in position and awaiting further orders. Roger that, and Big Sky. If you start in this green to deploy. A valley here, we might current enemy status at the site is unknown. Run into trouble. Um trying to find my scout here. So we need to choose a side. Either we go up on this side. Or we go to the left side. I think we will go to the left side. Seems to be more high ground here we can use. Okay, we can't see anything just yet. So getting our Rocketeer into full cover is a good idea. Mm, how about our sniper? We have Glenn, our medic, and I misclicked that. But. Hmm. Dash into full cover with our infantry. Sure, I want to have overwatches, but I think we will not get into a fight just yet. So we should be able to just dash. Let's do this. Running. Get my slower soldiers in front as well. Alright. So we have mutants. Let's continue up here. If you get our sniper on this position, this hill might be a position confirmed. good position. How we are going to get up there, I'm not sure. Well, he he has a grappling hook, so that's fine. Okay, boss. Okay. So right now we just keep making time. A rocketeer in the front here. And the assault isn't bad either to have. Moving to position. Hmm. Moving. Uh, not very quick though, so the meld might be gone. But uh, like uh, I mean. Hmm. Solid copy. I'm not sure if uh, Meld is the highest priority right now. Right, a mutant group in front of us. Okay, so we could try to move towards the meld here. Next turn I will most likely use the motion tracker. Hmm. Well done. 
I don't like to stand in the open like this. But I can't see much of a choice. Perhaps this way wasn't so good as I had hoped. Not this part at least. Like, no cover at all. We are sitting ducks here. Oops, I could have used this all the way up here. Oh well. would need uh, tactical rigging or whatever it's called when you have the chance to start using um, free items for every soldier. Look at this, the med is actually not that far away. Can we listen to this? Uh, nope. Alright. Hmm. I mean, we should be safe to get by this tree trunk here. Position confirmed. Oops. A lot of misclicks. Doesn't bode well. Oh well. Oh well. Roger Dodger. Yeah, let's follow suit here. It's not the sexiest approach, but yeah, as long as I'm not sure what we are facing, I'm not too keen going all in. And the UFO should be just out of range here. Don't miss it. Okay, this isn't actually going away. This turn either. It should be close enough to get it the next turn. Here's down there. The no one wants to get this full cover here. Nice full cover. Well, our assault isn't going to use it. I guess we have to use it with our medic. But if we get this meld here, we can play it really safe afterwards because I feel like that's. Hmm. Let's actually move our medic down here and get uh, Cusack up. Oh, we couldn't make it over there. Hmm. Oh well. So slow, but a lot of rockets, so shouldn't complain too much. The thing I've heard so far is mutants. Can we loot this up here? Oh, sure. Forty-six. So here is the UFO. And if we see at our landing zone, I don't want to fight here. Well, I want to have the aliens here, but I will not want to fight for full for half cover. Getting the aliens here might be dangerous because we might get uh, the command pod as well and if that's the case we are screwed since they will call for help Solid copy. Hmm. Well, yeah, the heading to that location. I'm not sure if this map is really big or what's up, but I mean, we should have gotten some 
contact soon, one might think. I guess not. You heard that too, right? Okay, so th that one we didn't hear, so that's the outsider. Now we heard some mutants again. Alright. Hmm. Three guys inside the UFO. I'm rolling. We've got multiple contacts. Whoops. Where did that guy go? The mechtoid here. Oh, we hit him. Alright. Um, so, the bad part is that I think this fourth square or square triangle here is the outsider. And then we had the mechtoid back here. And I would really, 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 really want to hit uh, the mech toy with my sniper. Um, but that will not happen, and my sniper can only shoot at that guy. That's a guaranteed kill, which is nice and all, but... Okay, let's find our... Infantry here. So who have smokes? Our soldier smokes and our medic has smokes. It's a decent shot for our medic. Is that enough to get down here if you trigger an overwatch? Uh! Okay, we didn't. Oh well. I kind of want you to hunker though. Alright. So we have an assault that can smoke some guys here. And we have a medic that can smoke. Scout, 10 hit points. Sniper Reno. Can everyone hunker? Kind of, but this guy might be able to flank us over here. Let's use our infantry here, which was a bad choice since I kind of want her to overwatch. Oh well, um, anchor, smoke. Can't throw the sham grenade all that far. Hmm. Watch Hunker and Hunker. I guess he will charge us here. Yeah. I'm just hoping he will not <laughs> one damage. I just hope that he will not uh, flank our gunner here. So, will he have covering fire? Let's use a shot from the smoke to see. Ah, okay, nope. 
mind fray. 55% chance to hit. That's pretty bad. With the mind fray that is. And you can't see him, really. Trees! Uh, snipers don't like trees. How about some uh, gunner action here? Shredding effect. Now we need to kill it though. Man, these... These things can take quite a beating. I should have used Shem Grenade, I guess. Um, will we be able to deal with this guy without Shem Grenades? Maybe, but I will have to use... I will have to use... Um, I guess I could have my rocket as... Option, but I think like I have to break this overwatch if I want to be able to do this without the Shem Grenade. Like I said, I should have used that in the beginning. Oh well, let's try it. I mean, I brought this for a reason. Yeah, no damage resistance at all now. It's pretty good. Come on, friendly! good that's good I hope that that uh, fourth triangle back here was the outsider and it wasn't like yeah, another mech toy because then you are screwed again let's bring you with us since you can't hit from through all the trees right it wasn't an outsider What's a Newton? What? Wouldn't mind a capture? Wouldn't mind full cover either with our Leaving. heavy here or a gunner. If he wasn't so close, the UFO I would go for a capture, but um, it's a little bit too risky. Friendly, you have so little health. Twice. Screw it, let's overwatch. I should have hunted down with friendly, but the good thing with mutants is that they usually don't run away too far. But he hasn't any cover, so that's why he's running back and forth, I guess. Damn it! I saw him for a split second. I don't want to run too close. Yes, I copy. Okay. Heading out. 
I just want to get a disarming shot here. Disabling shot, so that should be easy enough. We just need to get our engineer into some kind of position here. If you use the saving shot, he might uh, throw a grenade, but that's like all he can do really. But then the next turn he will be able to shoot. can move you with us as well so you can provide some kind of smokes so I'm thinking we, when we use disabling shot he will move up here and throw a grenade, grenade at these guys I'm on the move. nice angle best shot EU I'm not sure how I'm supposed to deal with this guy without tr triggering another group. But if you move forwards, okay, he didn't. Right, maybe we have to move back and just wait for another disabling shot here. Can't fight from half cover when he will have full cover. It's a really hard position to get any captures since he will just move away from us and we don't have any ways to like uh, stay out of cover or out of line of sight so we can get close enough to deal with him. Mind free as well. Which would be nice. Um, Location confirmed. This is my engineer. Hmm. She's kind of the furthest away of all. Okay, that's another group. That's a big mutant right there. And one inside as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Things are getting way too hot here. <clears throat> so we have four mutants here and... Uh, well, three mutants here, one mutant back here and a floater somewhere as well. Definitely need... A good rocket, and the only way to get a good rocket is to move back, but these trees don't provide a lot of cover. And if we hunker down here, this guy will come back and flank us. Here, I think, uh, but he kind of moved forward again. Mm 
Well, we don't need our medic in the front. Our scout in the front isn't that bad, but... So let's bring the scout back here. Bring our infantry back here. And our assault back here and hope that we don't get flanked by the last mutant. How about our engineer though? We are running out of trees here. See running. That's a nice thirty-four percent crit hit. That should be nice double move. And they are self buffing. Hmm. So uh, kind of a nice shot against that floater, but it's not a guaranteed kill. Go with a Jolo dash here with our <laughs> scout, ten hit point scout. I mean, uh, there are worse ideas. If we could go with disabling shots, but I think we might need it later. So I've seen a couple of uh, new videos from uh, XCOM 2 and it looks really awesome. Problem is if I try to break this whole what I need to dash. I feel like. And then I'm really in a bad position, especially now when I don't have I don't have um, the command nearby. Um, two hit points. <laughs> Stupid pistols. But yeah, it was a bit too far away for our scout to do any. No, I can't make it back up either. Well, come on. the rocket then. We have five of them, or we had five of them. Uh, it's not a good enough angle. So do we want smoke or not? Problem is, if I pop smoke, I will most likely get grenades. Away. I'm more afraid of losing friendly actually, since he only has 8 hit points. At the same time, he's pretty low level. Doesn't really make that much of a difference. Yeah, 
seems like no cover at all here. I want to keep you on this side to scout for the other guy. Let's see if this guy does. Nineteen percent chance hit for him. That comes with his friend. Watch, nope. Another coming fire in the face. He's doing great job, but he will get hit sooner or later. Well, he shot on the wrong side of that tree, so. Sniper time. Sweet. Let's rock. Hmm. Well, they should have one more mute on somewhere or two more. Fifteen HP though. Pretty legit. Time. Let's see if there is no watch yeah, somewhere. Okay, so we saw him for a split second, but not anymore, which makes me kind of nervous to use my running gun here, but. Close combat specialists. Yep. So hopefully he will move and trigger the Overwatch. Well, that we, we should call it the close combat specialist. So are we able to get in range? Damn it! Hmm. Half cover. I'm not. I'm not very tempted. Not very tempted at all. Hmm. So we could run up here. We should get vision on this guy. I could use command to use my mind fray, but I'm not sure my chance to hit. And she can't see him. Yeah, she can. Right. Fifty-five percent chance to hit. So bad. Is he flanking? Not sure. Solid shot. Moving out. So if we use suppression, at least he will not move and well, he might move anyways, but... but... Yeah... This is a bit wonky. Well, let's go with suppression. Maybe he will shoot at our suppression guy here. 100% shot. Damn it! He didn't go for the... I'm flanked, I need to run. Yeah, she's going down. 
Maybe not. Yeah, that critical hit wasn't very nice. Trigger. Oh, there is. Yeah, thankfully. You can't see this guy. Stupid trees. Always a little bit wonky with the line of sight here. Like that guy. Yes, Commander. No, <laughs> what? That can't be out of range, can it? We are in a really strange position now, I feel. Ten hit points. Ten hit points. I mean... Killing this guy isn't that hard. The hard part is to kill him and still be alive. And I mean, bringing friendly here, this guy will have line of sight. I was hoping that we would be able to shoot with uh, Android here. I mean, we had line of sight from here, then I moved up here, and we should be even closer to him, but now we don't have line of sight. That's such a strange thing. And if we move here, we should be able to kill this guy, but... Almost... I guaranteed... <laughs> Almost. So I need a mathematician to <laughs> explain to me if uh, 190 is better than 276. this right uh, now we kind of need a medic to get over here the sooner the better so we can flashbang this guy which is nice and all 
Did I misclick? Did I misclick? I misclicked. What's up with this? Why am I misclicking all the freaking time? Yeah, this will be interesting to say the least. Is uh, uh, disoriented. Uh, we could put acid on him as well. Okay, let's do it. That's our last shame, shame grenade, though. Now we have to decide if we want to go with Sabling Shot or an Ordinary Shot. Let's go with Sabling Shot again. We should have pretty bad chances to hit. That mutant will be pro <laughs> trouble them later on, though. So, friend, you might get uh, flanked, but uh, I believe in you. So, where's our engineer? Way back here. I think I misclicked again. Yeah, it's something strange when you are at the edge of the map here. You get kind of screwed. Don't figure the over seer, overwatcher. So I could run up here, I don't think it's close enough for stun the next turn, but we'll see. Moving. Take a shot, maybe, laser rifle, let's try the mine fray here. We should have pretty bad aim the next turn as well, even if he's not flashbang anymore. Okay. I kind of don't want to overwatch with uh, our infantry against that guy. Oh, this tree is gone. Right. Hum. hum hum. Eight hit points. It's quite risky. Take a shot like that. See what he does. Running away. It's running too quick for our engineer. Yeah, that's way too far away. Hmm. I'm 
attempted to kill him. If he was the only one active, I might risk it, but let's keep him alive one more turn here. Okay, found another guy. There's your friend. Yeah, now I really feel like we should kill him. When he got his friend here. All this for nothing. Getting it done. Yes, this is the best position for it. Heading there now. Reloaded. It's always moving back, that guy. But yeah, I think we have a good squad for capturing an alien. It's just that we have a small problem of with this map that it's so open we can't sneak up on them is that we have um, our abilities of cooldown again so come on move forward this time nope that's a lot of running around This is so YOLO. But uh, it will be fine. It will be fine. I hope that this is the last pod and the command pod, but I guess we'll find out. Even if I want to have um, Lone Wolf active, we need to keep you around here. Do you want more overwatches? this time around. Damn it. Seven hit points. I think we saw a lot of aliens. Okay. So how should we do seven damage? You have rain gear, so you might do too much damage. You might not have enough HP. <laughs> Hmm. 
If I move here, I think we will trigger a new group. So... Pistol shot. Rapid fire. Go. Is that one damage? I kind of think so. Uh, you have Ranger. Laser. Seven damage. I should use that first. I'm on it, Commander. I'm so bad at capturing aliens it, that it's Commander. embarrassing. I kind of don't want to move since we saw more aliens. I think when we moved up here with our engineer. Maybe not. Right. Copy that. So we. Act <laughs> yeah. Affirmative. Moving out. We really, really, really need Let's to capture at least freaking outsider. How hard can it be? I'm rolling. Problem is we don't have enough debuff. Well, we we have our sniper if we are able to find an angle, which we might not. Locked and loaded. Oh, we have mutants still. Maybe even active mutants? I think so, because it feels like they are really very close. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, this is bad. Bad news, bears. So... Will he be able to move all the way up here? It will be close. I think. Kind of committed here. We need to get our sniper to be able to shoot over there, which means that. Kind of should move Cusack here. He will have to stay in half cover. Hmm. 
position. On the move. Can you get back here, please? Plus. Yes, Commander. Damn it! I don't know where he is. We can check where we can move. But we can move everywhere. So he might have been moving backwards or he might go for this side. The problem is if we go and check this side out, we will trigger the outsider. So let's give it one more turn, then we then we go in guns blazing. Back here, but you hear that? Right, it's time, I think. He's definitely somewhere around here. Oh, there he is. Hello, Stun Plus. Best stunning ever! Didn't even need to use command, so that's good. So, let's bring some people closer here. Hmm. If we are able to get the outsider as well, that would be really awesome sauce. Friendly to the honors, I guess. Okay. So that's not an area where we can snipe him, though. Closer for any smokes or suppression or mine fade. I'm not sure how easy it is to mine fade those guys in the long war. I actually think it might be quite hard. Nor do I know how far they can sprint. So, where is our scout? All these guys look the same. Oh, this was the heavy. Oh, gunner. Oops. That was bad. Okay. Right. Twelve hit points. You can't see him. Really be able to run all the way. It's actually pretty close that he will be able to flank us, but I think we're safe.
If I stand on the corner here, I might get shot though. Who is this? Our assault. Our assault can handle the damage. So. I'll actually have my assault here. So we can see what's actually happen happening inside. Try to do this with our uh, scout this time around. It's kind of hard to find a good angle actually. So, okay, there is. <laughs> so bad we don't have any way of uh, reducing his. Combat efficiency. Moving out. Right, let's do it like this. We move everyone back, and then we blow a hole with the rocket launcher. The only problem with that is that we will not be able to use our command ability if we fail the first. If we fail the first uh, stunning attempt, or if we fail to blow up the wall. And we don't have any grenades. That's one, one bad move. One of many bad moves. So we could pop smoke, so he will not crit us and uh, rely on overwatches. I don't think we can stun him through the wall here. Doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. <sighs> Who can die from one shot? One non crit. It's uh, our heavy here. Running the risk of dying. So you could overwatch. How much damage can that do? 7 damage. He has 8 hit points. You can do 8 hit points with an overwatch shot. Eight hit points in full cover. Damn it. <laughs> Alright. This will be interesting. Oh, he has lightning reflexes. Good to know. So he will only flank our infantry. <laughs> More lightning reflexes here. Keep your head down, please. Oh, he was shooting the one uh, in full cover. Okay, can we get a freaking sniper shot now, please? Thank you. 
Alright, let's get the uh, holo targeting up. Someone that feels like it. I'm not sure if this is the the way you capture aliens, but uh, it is now. Good copy. Moving on target. I bet we will trigger group now, and they will just go in and murder us all. But So we should get you. The problem is that he will most likely. Well, yeah, he, never mind, he has lightning reflexes, so who cares? I'm tempted to take that shot, but. Let's see how far he can move here. Okay, yeah, our engineer will not be able to catch up. <laughs> what are we supposed to do? This is just silly. See if there's some chance to hit. Hmm. I mean, I can't use suppression to keep him down because he will just break suppression since he has the lightning reflex as well. I guess we could use the command ability. So, please, please be able to see her. Please. Thank you. Alright, so we need uh, 11 damage. Who can give us 11 damage? Problem is, if I use you, you will shredder him. Ho ho ho! Okay. Yeah, well. Please. Subduing target. Excellent work. Wee. All right. That was the longest mission ever with only 10 aliens. Damn. Oof. Oh well. Oh well, oh well, oh well. So promotions. Our assault got almost killed, that's bad. But friendly, you have so bad stats, you will just get all the medic skills. I kind of like the smoke and mirror stuff, but I'm thinking that, thinking, thinking that the revive might be useful, especially in exalt missions. And an engineer with repair. So... Extra damage to grenades, better smoke grenades, or the battle scanner. Since you don't have heat warheads, maybe you shouldn't go with mayhem. Just go with uh, battle scanner, since you will be the one that or have a utility thing here going. For captures and stuff. 
And then this is a battle scout thingy, so I would actually go with aggression here. I know it wasn't easy, but this could really be a turning point in our research. Not only can we interrogate the subject, but bringing an alien back alive provides us with a much better understanding of their physiology. <sighs> Impressive work indeed. Preparations in the containment facility are well underway. Alright. Thank you, Dr. Wallen. So we are getting lucky with the stun chances here. That's good. So now we can start interrogating aliens. And I think that's what we have to do. Interrogate the captive alien. Hmm. And we also got some money if you want more aircrafts. Might be an idea. Maybe. <laughs> Everyone is repairing. Maybe we should just get uh, more weapons for the aircraft still. Since they are repairing all the time. But I think we have to end this episode now because it's been a very long one. So I will scan for activity in the next episode. So thanks you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.